you little ratchies. No, I'm joking. Uh, you're right. Uh, we're gonna do a bit of bit of spinning today on the heavy rod, maybe on the light rod, and uh, probably catch some macro, but you never know, might catch something else. And um, if I'm feeling frisky, we'll do a bit of a catching cook on a portable barbecue that I brought because it's been on my car for ages. So why the hell not? Let's see how we do it. Got just a little dimple spinner, about 40 grams. Uh, on a Maximus Z Energy, uh, I think it goes up to something like 50 grams or something, uh, which is a bit heavy, but it lets me cast far and fling the heavy lures out. So we'll see how we do. And we're on. Oh, what a fight! It's been a, it's been a while. I don't know if this is foul hooked or. I lost it. Lost it. That did not feel like a macro. Come on. This one's definitely a mackerel. That's a... Quite a big one. That's... The macro, that's as big as... As big as you're gonna get around here, I think. We will, uh... Get the hook popped out and uh, get them dispatched. It's a uh, first macro of the year. Feels good. Now, I could catch macro all day, but I'll probably only need maybe two to three, something like that, just for a good old meal or two. Um, so we'll have a couple more spins on the dimples and then maybe move to some soft plastics or some, some barbless. See how it goes from there. Try and catch one more though. Here we go. There must be a lot of them out here because they always seem to hit it on the drop. Like that, there we go. God, it's been a while. This feels like a much smaller one than the last one. I almost, I didn't think he was on, but he, he's, he's still on there. 
This feels tiny. This might even be a, uh, a sand eel, maybe, or a, a lawn. I don't know, definitely a mackerel. It's kicking towards the end, so. Uh, it's a bit of a skinny one, but uh, it'll do anyways. And he's much, much smaller than the uh, the last one and he's unfortunately the treble hooks have got him bad anyway so that's why I'll be switching uh, over to some soft plastics after this one probably it's just so I'm not killing any without kind of meaning to or without being necessary so I'll get them dispatched right we're gonna try one more on the uh, on the light rod that I've brought which is uh, 5 to 20 grams I think it is Just to see how it feels. I've never caught one on this before, so it should give a little bit of a battle. Um, make sure I've got a decent drag set. Not too loose, not too tight. Um, should be able to get in the caster range with this, but um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. I think we should be fine. Here we go. Yeah, uh, I think the tide's coming in quite quite hard at the minute, so the waves are starting to come over, which always sketches me out here. Uh, because you can get some pretty nasty rogue waves, uh, and you hear stories of people getting knocked off around here, so you've got to have your wits about you. So then, why? Takes a while for this one to sink with it being, uh, I think it's a 15 gram wedge. Here we go. Actually, it doesn't feel like a big one if it is a mackerel. Even on the light rod, it's actually been easier to bring this in than what the heavy rod was. Yeah, it's a mackerel, decent size as well. I have no idea. The colors on them are so beautiful. There we go. Hi, 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 hi. Well, look like I've murdered someone now. But I think that's my whack for the mackerel. I don't think I'll be taking much more than that, so. Enough for some bait, enough for some food. That'll be me. Probably switch over there. I don't know, I might try some, some surface lures or something. I'm, I haven't really give those a try around here. But I imagine I'll probably take on to a, a few more macro in the process, but I've got like one more or something and then I'm at my limit, so I might have to pack up after then, but we'll see how it goes. Well, I may or may not have just slipped and fell in the water, but um, luckily I didn't hurt myself, so uh, just gonna cook up some of the mackerel I've already filleted on the rocks over there. And uh, yeah, that's it, just gonna have me dinner really. Enjoy the views. So, uh, it got pretty busy towards the end there. I stayed for about an hour or two after the last mackerel. Uh, 
tried some surface glues, some subsurface glues, and then back on the spinners, and still didn't really have any luck. So called it a day. I'm gonna sit here, have me dinner. I've had a couple of mackerel. That's all I need. Gonna wait until the coals are nice and white. In the car, time to go home. Eh? I didn't really uh, show anything of me actually eating the fish, but uh, I can assure you it was nice. Just ate one. I'll uh, eat the rest later or use them for bait. See how it goes. It is scorching like it's boiling in this car. Uh, but yeah, it's been a good day. Um, thanks. <laughs>